Hey YouTube, Big D here, and I've got my video game pickups for this week. The date is 7-9-2011. I've been busy, so I haven't made videos, but I have a bunch more to be making. These are the games I've picked up. I got a system. Oh, I forgot a Pikachu N64 down there for 30 bucks last week. Um, alright, I guess we'll start with this stack. Puzzle Kingdoms for DS. Very nice condition. Complete. It was, uh, 350. One verse 100. DS. Also complete, very nice condition. There's three bucks. PS1 Road Rash 3D Greatest Hits, minty like this. It's a buck fifty. Medal of Honor Underground Black Label, complete. Also a really nice disc was a buck. Siphon filter. I think this is it's only one disc. The first game. I think it's only the first disc. And then from Siphon Filter 2, Disc 2. They were just extras. I think they were I think I paid for like 50 cents each for them. Siphon filter 2. This one's missing disc one. Got the manual though. I think I might have a couple extra discs from it. Better disc one. This was 50 cents. Greatest hits. Oh, another one. Siphon filter two. Has the first disc, the manual, and the second disc in case, so it's complete. Also 50 cents. PS3. Bioshock 2, mintiness, case feels brand new, so does the manual, disc looks new, this was $4.50, so buy one get one free for 9 bucks, which is awesome. Breath of Fire Dragon Quarter for PS2. It's in a black blockbuster case right now. I have an extra case up there that has the manual in it for it, actually. So I took it out of here so the manual is getting ruined because there's not enough space for it in this case. This is an RPG. So I picked it up. It was three bucks. Genji Don of the Samurai. Mint, mint, mint. Everything's mint. The case feels brand new. The manual looks mint. Disc is definitely mint. Case looks mint. Got that today. It was a buck fifty. For the 360 Madden 06. Missing the manual. It was 50 cents though. So I picked that up. Army of Two. 360, very nice shape, complete, it was, I don't know, fucking know, four bucks I think, time shift, another blockbuster case, I have an extra 360 case up there also, and I'm going to put it in, I just got to remove the sticker from the case, because I hate this case. Or these cases. It's pretty minty actually. It was two bucks and fifty cents. I think I have like three or four copies of it now. Platinum hits, Ghost Recon, Advanced Warfighter. Complete. Picked up the greatest hits of the second one about a week or two ago. This one was a uh, buck fifty. Today I got Connect Adventures. I like the purple case, my favorite color. 
don't have a connect yet, but this was only a buck fifty-two. It's mint. Probably wasn't played much, but I like the purple case, so I bought it. Also today I picked up Platinum Hits Gears of War. Comes with the bonus disc, has all the extra content, map packs and stuff that I didn't actually know were on Platinum Hits games. So that's cool. Can't wait to get all the extra maps and stuff in there. Oh, that was two fifty. Also I picked up the darkness today for two fifty. Missing the manual though. I think I have four copies of that game also. Next couple of NES games, very minty, except they have a name written on the cart down here. It's American Gladiators, Super Glossy Label, Dusk Slaves, everything. And Pac Man. I paid two bucks each. A couple days ago. Super Chase HQ, Super Nintendo. Pretty nice looking game. I paid two bucks for it. Haven't seen it before. Dino, Dino City. Super Nintendo. This is an extremely rare game. I bought it off eBay. Got it for I think like six bucks shipped, which isn't bad. Next, we got some N64. A lot of duplicates, but a couple things that weren't. Um, let's see. These two GT64, Gran Turismo, the uh, Championship Edition. Battle Tanks. Uh, my girlfriend picked these up, so I don't know prices. NFL Blitz 2001 and Virtual Pool. The Virtual Pool is stained with like coffee or something. Girlfriend also picked up. Put these back here for cleaning. These there because they've already been cleaned and tested. Also, my girlfriend picked up these few games. Extreme G, Wave Race, Excite Bike, Jeopardy, and NASCAR 99. So, got those for free, which is awesome. Um, Uh, one Game Boy game, WWF Warzone. It's got a sticker in the bag. More N64 stuff. Most of them are duplicates. All-Star Baseball 99. I thought I didn't have this, but I might. But it's a nice looking cart, so... Label upgrade at least. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. Just duplicates, got stickers on it, took them off, got a use goo going on its ass. These were a buck of piece. WWF Attitude, same thing, had stickers on it, sticker residue, it was a buck. Cruising USA. This is the non player's choice version, so I need it for my collection, it was a buck. I got these four today also. Resident Evil. Well, it says Resident Evil 3 Nemesis, which that would have been awesome if somebody hacked it somehow to play that. Because I'm the biggest Resident Evil fan ever. But it's not. It's Duke Nukem. Whatever it is. Zero Hour. They're just retarded. And they don't even know how to spell Nemesis. It's N E M E I S I S. Test of this though, it is Duke Nukem. So that was collection. 1080 snowboarding, very nice looking cart. It was a buck. Uh, better than my other one in my collection, so that's going in there. 
this was also five bucks. Another one, not in great condition. Just another buck. Just got it to uh, use as trade bait. Gauntlet Legends in my collection. Usually sells it for twelve bucks. He gives me some good deals at the gaming store when I buy a bunch of stuff. I spent ninety bucks. He gave it to me for five bucks. So I wanted it. it. Was one of the ten or fifteen games on the high end of my list. And then I got a Coleco Vision. Paid forty bucks for everything. In here. There's twenty five games and you know, other various shit. Controller expansion. Uh, um, two controllers, the expansion deck, the system. I think that's about it. But. As it falls to the ground. Try to make sure that I got every game out of there. First, we got Quest for Quantana I think this is a $50 game, actually. Oh, by the way, I got the whole Coleco set for 40 bucks total. The systems alone go on eBay for 70 plus. Papa. Amador. Big ass gorilla in there. The damn busters. Combat. For the 2600 asteroid for the 2600, which are duplicates. I got like seven of each. Donkey Kong, Gorf, I think that's expensive too. Ladybug, another Donkey Kong, Congo Bongo, Cubert. Donkey Kong Jr. Super Action Baseball. Oh, a lot of these carts are minty labels. Glossy labels, too. And they're 32 years old or something. Time Pilot. Pepper, too. Sewer Sam. I think that's an expensive game. Um, Mr. Do. Zaxxon. Another Donkey Kong, like the third one or fourth one or something. Mousetrap, that's expensive too. Mountain King. Burger Time. And the fourth Donkey Kong. So. Right here, got a controller, joystick thing. Another one. We have the uh, upgrade thing, expansion pack, the RF plug in, regular plug, power cord, system, and another game, Carnival. So, all in all, the system with the 25 games is 40 bucks. I'm going to be getting a Commodore 64 also. It's um, the game store guy. Anyone's going to sell it to me. He says he's got three huge ass boxes. We're talking like from here to here. Like two cushions full each box. Three boxes full of game. Of cart games. So that's massive money right here. He says like 150, 200 bucks total. I'll get him down to 150. So thanks for watching my pickups for 
week 26 or 7, whatever it is. The. I don't know. 9th of uh, July here. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Oh, and stay tuned to my Pokemon cards that I have incoming, I guess. There were a couple manuals with the Coleco and Atari stuff. And I just got these today. Just random manuals. So, bye.